Hi guys, this is Man of Yogo and Cream.com. Yes, the other half of Yogo and Cream. And I know it has been a while since we last posted a video, but this time around, I'm posting a video because I want to help promote Philippines National Food Fair 2019. And for this video, as the title suggests, I'm sharing with you guys my haul. Um, I think I only spent 500 pesos for this, for what I bought, because I don't know how much budget is in my budget. But I have a lot of things I want to buy there. They have Malagos chocolate from Davao. They have products from Visayas. As in, so many things. Like, pati vegan longganisa. Yun nga yung gusto ko sana bilhin. Kaso yun nga. Um, I just went to a trip to Port Barton, which is in San Vicente, Palawan. So, medyo wala na akong budget. Anyway, so, yeah. Let's see what I got. Um, isa sa mga nabili ko is this JES kita ba yan? JES Boneless Bagoong What makes this special is that yun, boneless siya uh, which is like balayan if you're familiar with balayan bagoong pero um, the flavor of this is with chili and calamansi they have a taste test there and ang sarap niya kasi timplado na yung bagoong maalat na maasim na may onting ang hang ang sarap and um, na-imagine ko tong gagamitin ko siya sa paborito kong salad which is salted egg na may kamatis and speaking of salted egg isa sa mga pinaka-awesome find doon is this curved and Preet's Gourmet Salted Egg. I think this is around 120 pesos. Ay, nakalimutan ko pala sabihin yung price na ito. This is around 45 pesos, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, 45 pesos. And this is around 100 to 120. I forgot the exact price. Pero yun, I know medyo pricey siya kasi 6 pieces lang and then 120. Pero, sobrang sulit. Like, ang sarap niya kasi gourmet salted egg siya. Hindi siya masyadong maalap. And ang balita ko, yun nga, uh, hindi mo na siya kailangan i-ref kasi yung shelf life niya, 3 months without fridge. And it has 30% less sodium, 50% less cholesterol because they're using chicken egg. And when you eat this, well, I tried it, wala siyang lansa, walang odor. Best for salads, if nababahuan kayo sa salted egg, uh, dito, hindi kayo mababahuan kasi wala siyang, yun nga, wala siyang odor. And it's the only salted egg brand na given with an um, FDA food registration. Pag tinitingnan ko siya, mukha siyang foreign brand. Yung logo, yung packaging niya. Pero, this is actually made in the Philippines. San Jose, Batangas. So, I guess, they made it this way kasi they export siguro sa US. Ayun. Uh, expiration na ito is on June 18, 2019. Ang ganda, ang galing. I'm so amazed with Philippine ingenuity. No? And, of course, nahilig ako sa chips. So, habang nag-over kumakain, gusto ko may kinakain akong chips. And I got this cassava chips from Kagapa. And this also, this came from Zamunga. Yeah. It's a product of the Pitan City, Zamunga del Norte. Um, maraming binibentang cassava chips doon. There's actually um, mushroom chips then Uh, mushroom chicharon, seaweed chicharon. Pero, this is one of the good finds for me. Kasi, 100 pesos, tatlo na siya. And it comes in different flavors. Sour cream, barbecue, and cheese. Nung tinaste test ko siya, ang gusto ko sa kanya, 
yung flavor niya is evenly distributed. Like, pag kinain ko, nandun talaga yung flavor niya. Kumakapit siya dun sa chips. Yung iba kasing na-try ko, na-taste test ko, pagkain ko ng chips, hindi masyadong lasang-lasa. They would give out a reason na, oh, kasi mild lang, ganun. Pero, since nilagyan ng flavor, feeling ko, for me, dapat lasang-lasa yung flavor. ba? Diba? Another interesting find is this instant noodles pancit hab-hab. Kita ba? Itong pancit hab-hab, ayan, um, authentic uh, noodles, Filipino noodles. Habab is famous in Quezon. Pero now, we don't have to go to Quezon anymore to eat hab-hab. Kasi, we can do it in our home. Ito, uh, nandiyan na yung noodles and meron na rin siyang kasamang sauce. And this instant hab-hab noodles is just for 20 pesos. Ang cool, no? And okay siya kasi may cooking instruction siya. Para mas maging authentic yung hab-hab experience. Uh, it's recommended that you blanch carrots, sayote, and pechay. Tapos, isama mo siya sa pag-prito or pagluto mo na itong pancit hab-hab. Ayan o. And, it's easy to cook. 3 minutes lang daw siya para lutuin. And, isang ganito pala is good for 2 persons. Eh, bumili ako ng dalawa. So, I guess, ayan. Pag nagtitipid ako ng bonggang-bongga, ito na. And, last but not the least, ito favorite ko to. I flew to Zamboanga last year and I ate at Denny's Coffee Garden. Isa sa mga sikat na delicacies doon, or like, pasalubong, yan, delicacy, is this ja. Kita ba yan? Itong ja, uh, tawag sa tausog ja, pero sa Zamboanga, it's famously called as lokot lokot. Uh, what's great about this is that each piece ay niluluto ng women isa-isa sa isang kawali. So, um, made with love siya and yes, mas matagal yung process pero masarap siya. Ang pagkakaalam ko, yung process niya, yung mixture, ipapadaan nila sa isang coconut shell na may mga butas, de derecho dun sa isang kawali. Then, pipirituhin nila. And, i-roll nila hanggang maging ganito. And, there are two varieties of this. It's either regular or with vanilla extract. Super gusto ko siya, kaya bumili ako. Nagkikrave ako actually nito. Kaya, ang saya ko na they went to the National Food Fair. So, we can purchase this without, without going to Zamboanga. Kasi, hindi ito readily available sa mall. So, I suggest, I highly recommend na if you go to National Food Fair, look for products na hindi mo basta-basta mabibili sa mall or like sa kultura ng SM. Diba? This is best eaten when you have coffee. And, ayan. This is the coffee that I recommend. Perfect siya for this one. Partner sila, both from Dennis Coffee Garden. This is Kahawa Soup. It's Sulu Coffee. And bago na yung packaging nila. Yung packaging nila, this is a um, painting from their latest branch. And masarap to kasi uh, strong siya. Pero like, hindi siya mapait. Robusta coffee, matapang kaya paglaban. Pero hindi mapait. Inumin. Kaya sobrang gustong gusto ko to. And since 1962 pa ito, yun lang yung share ko sa inyo. Medyo onti lang yung nabili ko. Ito lang yung kasya ng aking budget. Ayan. Marami pa akong food finds na uh, gustong i-share sa inyo. Pero if you want to know more about the other food finds, yung mga interesting like stingless bihon, the okay? Stingless bee honey. Yes, honey from a stingless bee. Meron din nun. Marami pa. As in, sobrang dami. You can check more about those products in our blog, yogaandcream.com. Hindi na siya video, but you can read. And if you're interested, 
to buy this product, please don't miss going to the National Food Fair 2019! Okay, bago. And pasensya na pala sa malas kong voice kasi nag-party tayo. And ang daldal ko, nag-travel ako, ang dami kong nakachikang friends. That's it for this video. And the la 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 Thank you for bearing with me and I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you also visit National Food Fair un until it's still there. The event is still there in SM Mega Mall. Anyway. So thank you guys for watching this video. If you like this video, please hit the like button. And please don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos on food and travel. And I'm so excited to share with you guys. Will um my Taiwan travel video will be uploaded soon as well as our well other videos pa. More food food videos and of course my Port Martin video in San Vicente Palace. Yun lang guys. Thank you.